Hi, in this activity, we will configure point-to-point -point single OSPF V2. As you can see on screen, we have three routers and they are connected to each other using the point-to-point -point links. And now we configure uh, the OSPF V2 for the three routers and then we will configure passive interface for each LAN interface of each router. And lastly, we will verify the OSPF configuration. Firstly, before configuring the OSPF, we will set the router ID for each router. On router 1, we will set the router ID on the router OSPF. 10 and router ID port, port, port 1 okay you do the same on router 2 and router 3 to verify the router ID we use a command do show IP protocol and you see this uh, our this router has the router ID on the OSPF 10 process. Next, we will configure networks for OSPF routing. On router 1, we will use a white card mask. To understand about white card mask, you should read uh, the uh, guide here. And on router 1, I will enter the network network with the network address. You see the router one connect to uh, this network, this network and the LAN network. So to uh, configure routers uh, routing for this network, I will uh, enter the command. I will. Uh, Zoom it and uh, network 10.1.1.1 because it's last 30, so the Y card mark is 0 .0 .0 0.0.0.3 area 0. And do the same on uh, this network dot 4. And for the LAN network, we will use. Uh, Two nine one six eight ten dot dot zero and the Y card match is two five five because if the the Y card match uh, the subnet match here is twenty four. Another way of configure networks for OSPF routing is using interface IP addresses and quad zero mask. So on router two, we will do that. You network uh, and we must take the uh, IP address for each interface on router two. For example, serial uh, zero slash one slash zero router 2 0 and this is the IP address of that interface so I enter the IP address network 10.1.1.1.2 with the white card mark area Zero. Do the same on the at zero one one. And then for the gigabit.
and after configuring router OSPF on router 1 and router 2 we will verify it by using to show IP OSPF neighbor you see the neighbor of router 1 is router 2 and with the uh, interface that discover the uh, the neighbor and now on part 3 we will uh, sorry on step 3 we will configure OSPF routing on router interface uh, we should use the interface configuration mode and set the command IP OSPF the process ID and the area ID now on router 3 I will check for the uh, three interfaces. Uh, sit interface gigabit zero zero IP OSPF ten area zero and interface at zero. Slot one, slot zero, and interface. Keep zero. Area zero, and we get the agency C log message uh, to uh, discover the neighbor two 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 on serial and you can we can do show IP OSPF interface the gigabit the serial one zero one uh, zero and only two So we should check for the one one this one and interface at zero one slot one IP OSPF ten area zero this one oh, sorry this one and we can see the message the neighbor one 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 on serial zero slot one slot one and we can show do show IP OSPF neighbor you see router 3 had two neighbors and lastly we will uh, configure passive interface and verify OSPF configuration uh, as you know uh, OSPF will send its protocol traffic out of all interfaces that are participating in the uh, OSPF process on links uh, on the LAN links that are not configured to other networks this unnecessary traffic uh, consumed resources so we will set the passive interface for the LAN interface. Uh, for example, on router one, I will uh, set the passive interface for this interface. The gigabit zero 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 interface G passive interface. Uh, sorry, on the not on the config duration mode it's on the router mode router OSPF 10 so it's acid router OSPF 10 passive interface gigabit 0 0, 0. you do the same on the uh, on the LAN interface on router 2 and router 2 
And lastly, we will verify OSPF configuration by using the show command like show uh, IP OSPF interface, uh, so router OSPF uh, neighbor. That is all for this activity guide. Thanks for watching.